With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. We have the question that a block of mass M1 is 1 kg is attached to the spring of the force constant K is equal to 24 Newton per centimeter at the one end and attached to the spring tensions of the mass M2 is 12 kg. Reduce the frequency of oscillation of the system if M2 is initial supported in the hand and then suddenly released. Find the instantaneous tension after uh, just just after M2 is released. The maximum displacement of M1, the maximum and the minimum tension in the spring during the oscillation. Okay, so first of all, we have to find the first of all we have to find the given thing uh, that is frequency so to obtain the frequency we know that the time period is equals to solution here to obtain the frequency we know that time period is simply equals to 2 pi under root time period is simply equals to 2 pi under root m by k now m is similarly we know that there is two masses so m will be equals to m1 plus m2 so 2 pi under root m1 plus m2 is what 600 uh, sorry 6 and now 24 newton per meter is k so k is 24 newton per meter uh, per centimeter so we have to convert it into meter so it will be 24,000. So it will be come to be pi by uh, 10 second. Just solve this, and it will become to be pi by 10 second. Okay. Now we got the time period. Now frequency is one by time period. Frequency will come up to be 10 by pi hertz clear i think it will be clear now we have to find the reduce the frequency of the system if m2 is initially supported in the hand then suddenly release okay so now we can also calculate the omega here so so that will be 2 pi f so it will become up to be 20 radian per second okay so I think this will be clear to you. Now the question is asking that uh, in instantaneous tension just after M2 is released. So when the M2 is released, the instantaneous tension is zero and it is the minimum. So just after M2 released, m2 released then tension is zero and that is the minimum part okay so the maximum displacement of m1 so how you will calculate uh, the maximum displacement of the m1 will be calculated when the spring and the mass is reduced so how you will calculate we will calculate this that kx is equals to m2g okay so kx is equals to m2g this is the another thing and this is the next part m2g so x will be equals to 5 multiplied by 10 divided by 2400 so it will become up to be 50 upon 2400 so it will be approx approx 25 divided by 12 centimeter okay so we have find it the 24 divided by centimeter that is or uh, the maximum displacement of m1 okay so the maximum displacement of m1 when will be the maximum displacement of m1 when the m2 will be moved so when m2 will move we find the maximum displacement of m1 that is x that is 25 by 12 centimeter clear 
So now the maximum and the minimum tension is distinct during oscillations. We have find the minimum. So the maximum is T max. Find the minimum that is zero. T max tension in the maximum that will be equals to M two G plus M two omega square A. So that will be M two G plus M two omega square A is somewhat nearby. Uh, 25 divided by 1200 so it will be come up to be the end fifty uh, that is fifty plus five multiplied by t multiplied by five. Four hundred because it is twenty square and uh, it is twenty five divided by twelve. So well, it is come up to be three twenty five divided by three newton. Okay, so this is your maximum tension. You can calculate this. So I hope you will get your answer. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.